Ah, cucuracha. Here we are at McDonald's. Do you see that roach? Look at this. That's a good one and a half. Look, look, look right here. <laughs> okay, uh, you guys recognize this symbol. You guys are from America. You're watching this. What is the name of this restaurant in Brazil? McDonald's. 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 I would like a Biggie Mackey. Biggie Mac. <laughs> Hilarious. Milkshake. What? Milkshake. Do you want a milkshake? <laughs> Milky shake. They add an E at the end of everything. That's just how they do it here. Because if it's if it's American, it's gotta have an E. That's just how it is. So our adventure at McDonald's has come to an end. It is almost 2 a.m. Heading back to the hotel. So continuing continuing the whole name thing, they call me Marky. Whenever they say like, "What's your name?" I say Mark. They're like, "What?" What? And I say, Marky, they, oh, okay. Uh, Tyrone is not Tyrone, it's... Chironi. 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 It's, it's not Danny Ramirez, it's Danny Ramirez. Hi. It's not Roots Reggae, it's Hoots Hege. Some girl said, Mark, Hello? how come you don't play Hooftop? My Carlos. favorite song is Carlos. Hooftop. Carlos. Hooftop <laughs> yeah, equals Carlos. rooftop. What did the girl say to you today, baby? Uh, she said, I love you. What's your name? <laughs> that is the Brazilian way to say, you know what, it makes sense though because the word, the, le the letters E is E, right? The letter E is E, right? Yes. And so N-A-M-E would be Nami. So that's how they do it in Brazil. So this is our hotel lobby. Bom dia. That's about the only way I can communicate with people. Sunday today. How are you guys doing? Well, you're good. How are you doing, Kevin? I'm good. I've just uh, got another cancel man. A cancel show? What happened? Um, so just cancel and Kevin just booked in another place. How is it possible that he can cancel and book that easy? I mean, that quick. Is a show cancel? Which one? I think that there is an angel. An angel? Yeah. Hovering over him. Hovering yeah. over one shoulder. Helping him book. Uh, no, while the devil is hovering us. over the other yeah, one. Exactly. Canceling. Yeah, oh my gosh. It's just God. Which show was it? In Goiânia. Because Hobson, the promoter of Amadora Cristã, canceled the show. He booked, he signed the contract and he canceled. So now Kevin is doing a miracle. <laughs> Friday for next Friday has been cancelled because the pastor was scared that is um, he won't be able to actually do the show in the time he has blah 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 so I just got off the phone to um, one of our great friends in Grania Pastor Adriana and she said Kevin do you know what I'm gonna do this event I'm confirming I'm gonna do it I'm gonna take care of it um, I'm not gonna depend on anyone else I am doing this event and just got the phone to us. She wants all the details. She wants our flyer so that she can start getting our flyers printed out. Um, how many people need to go in the hotel so she can put what the What day of the week is this show? Oh, right. So it's Sunday today. Yeah. And it's on Friday. This Friday. <laughs> you just booked a show five days out? Yes. Oh, the Lord works in mysterious ways. Right, I just gotta go upstairs and, and you want one of his mysterious ways. I just gotta go upstairs and send her the email. And then I'll be back down. So, finally, eventually, um, I confirmed the show in, next Friday in Grania. At the venue, which was always my plan A to start off with, which is where I told the initial promoter to do the event. It's a big place, huh? It's a big place. How big? 
4,000 people, 5,000 maybe. All right. So we are booked. Yes. <laughs>